Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be a body shop haul. They had a promotion on recently that was 40% off. So I stocked up on a few bits that I always use from there and got a couple of new bits as well. My hay fever is back with a vengeance today. I don't know what's going on. I have taken a hay fever tablet, but my eyes won't stop watering and my nose is running. So I've not got any mascara on. Now, I did have some on a little while ago because I was going to do this video, but it just kept running and everything. So, I'm going to try and get through this video without sniffing too much, without sneezing, and without having to blow my nose or wipe my eyes. Fingers crossed. So, the first thing I actually went into the body shop for, this was the only thing I actually bought in store. The rest I just got on their website. And, sorry, that was probably really noisy. So, it came in a pack and it was £14 and apparently the contents are worth 20 so, the reason I actually went in there was for the chamomile cleansing butter. So, I've done a review on this, which I will leave in the eye cards. I think it's the eye cards, the white thing that pops out at the top. And I really, I love this. And I've not used it for a long time. And I'm hoping it's still the same. And it still smells the same. Just looks like this. And it's just like a hard butter, really. And... I just feel that it takes your makeup off really really well and it just leaves your skin feeling so soft so this is what I went in to get and I saw that it was in a package but I was like I don't really need the other bits to be honest so I just took this up to the counter and the ladies behind there showed me the package again and it's like look you're paying this is already £10 on its own so you're going to get the other two bits for like, 40, uh, for like £4 extra so I thought I'd give it a go so this is the Camille Gentle Eye Makeup Remover. Now, I don't use eye makeup remover as such, like just eye makeup remover on its own. So I'll use my face wipes to take my makeup off, and then I'll use the stuff that I'll use on my face to take off my eye makeup as well. So I think with this, I'm going to try it and see if it takes off like all makeup and not just eye makeup. I'm hoping it does because... If it does just take off eye makeup, I'm probably not going to have that much use for it, to be honest. But, I'm thinking, if it takes off eye makeup, surely it's going to take off other makeup as well. Like, I, To me, it just means, if something's like an eye makeup remover, then it's still taking off makeup. So, surely that will take off foundation and all of that as well and I've just read the back and it says gently and effortlessly effortlessly that's it effortlessly why can't I say it gentle and effortlessly removes makeup from lashes and lids so if it can take off mascara and eyeshadow eyeliner and all of that then surely it can take off foundation as well but I will try it let me know if you've used this to take off makeup or doesn't work that well and just use it for eye makeup let me know and then it also comes with a muslin cloth so I could use a muslin cloth with this and obviously with the hot cloth cleansers that I've got I could use that with them so I ended up buying the little package of them and got another product that I can try so then went online and did a shop I was going to include the bits that my mum got as well because we kind of like just combined the order but I was at work when the package was delivered and when I got home she was like oh, I've taken my bits out and put them all away so I was like fine I'll just use my bits for the haul so I stocked up on two more of the round cotton pads these are normally I would say very rare to get in store but a lot of the time if I go in store and try and find these, they might have one pack, they might have a whole basket full, or more cases than not, they don't have any. So whenever they do deals on them, I'm going to put an order in, I always stock up on these. So I've got two packs of them, and also two packs of the square ones. And I use the round ones for if I'm just cleansing and toning my face. So if I've had a no makeup day and after a shower I'm just cleansing and toning, then I just use the round ones. But if I've worn makeup and I've had a shower, washed my face, I then still use makeup remover and then cleanse and tone. So I use the square ones because I can normally use up, like use just one for the makeup remover, the cleanser and the toner. So I can use these for more things than the round ones. 
I then got two of the hand creams. If you've not tried these hand creams before, I would highly recommend them. They smell so good, like most things from the body shop, to be honest. But I got a strawberry one and a pink grapefruit. The pink grapefruit is my favourite smell of anything they do in the body shop. Absolutely love the pink grapefruit smell of the shower gel, the body lotion, like everything. I just, I love how citrusy and oh, fruity the smell is. I just love it. Can't get enough of the smell of this. And if you've not smelt it, oh, just drop the lint, try to find it. If you've not smelt it, then where have you been? Go in and smell the pink grapefruit. It's amazing. Sorry, didn't get through it. Just had to blow my nose. It's starting to run. I then got this, which is the Vitamin E Moisturiser, and I love this for night, and I did think the one that I got before was different, so I think I must have got the wrong one before, because this is the Sink In Moisture Sleeping Mask, which I think is the one that I normally do use, and the one that I've got now, when I looked at it, I was like, I'm sure this was bigger when I used it before, but I just thought, like anything, it got smaller and still cost the same price, like most things do, but... I realise now, I think it might have been this one that is, because this is the 100ml, and I think the one I've got now is the 50ml, I think. So I think that this is the one that I used before. And I love it. Absolutely love it. Just, just a wobbly cream and a wobbly cream. That's a really bad description of something. Just a wobbly cream. And it's just a really good moisturiser, and it's vitamin E, which my skin seems to love. So... I got this one and then the last thing I got was a body butter now I don't normally use their body butters they're not something that I go in and repurchase a lot but I saw this one and I had to have it because of what it said it smelled like so I sometimes find their body butters a bit too thick and a bit too greasy so say i don't normally buy them but i saw this one and my favorite fruit ever is pineapple and this has got pineapple and coconut extracts from the caribbean apparently so this is called the pinta colada i think that's how it said pinta colada and basically just because it had pineapple in the name i bought it i'm not well, I'm saying, I was going to say, I'm not keen on coconut spill. I don't like coconut spill. don't like the taste of coconut. I don't like the smell of coconut. Just, I just, not for me. It's not my smell. So I was a bit like, is it going to smell more of pineapple or more of coconuts? But I just thought I'd get it anyway, because if not, my mum would use it. And thank goodness it smells more of pineapple. I can smell a hint of coconut in it. But for me, definitely the pineapple smell completely overrides the coconut smell. So to me, it just smells like pineapple. And, oh, oh my god, it's so nice! I can't wait to use that. It's so it smells so good. So they did have other ranges in with this. They had the shower gel, and they had some other bits with this smelling. So now that I've smelt this and love it, I might have to go and get the shower gel. I will see. I don't know if it's limited edition. Um, I know that they do bring out limited editions, but it doesn't say on here that it's limited. Or anything so fingers crossed it's not because it really smells amazing and that's everything that is my box empty let me know if you've been shopping in the body shop and if you've bought anything that you recommend that I try and I will see you in my next video bye